Saugus' Troy Williams is ghost-like on the football field. Just when defenders think they might have him wrapped up, poof, he's gone. His elusiveness allowed him to rush for over 1,500 yards and 21 touchdowns in his senior season. These impressive stats came after a junior year in which he totaled just 15 yards due to an ankle injury. In a high school full of centurions, nobody embraces the warrior mentality more than Troy himself. He readies himself for battle every Friday night. I've just been working just extra hard, just getting extra work before weight room in the morning and just after practice. And the linemen have been getting extra work with me too, so it's just a combination of those things have great results. Troy's breakout season was no accident. Aside from his diligence, there have been other components that allowed Williams to excel in his senior year. And number one is that he's healthy. Uh, number two, I mean, he's taken on a tremendous leadership role and taken it upon himself to, to really challenge himself and his teammates. And, uh, you know, he's really worked extremely hard uh, within the scheme of what we do to uh, have success, and, and that's what's happened for him this year. At only 5'8", it seems as if Troy almost disappears during plays only to reappear eight to 10 yards down the field. No wonder then one of his hobbies is ghost hunting. It entails, you know, a lot of, a lot of fun and kind of scary moments, I guess you could say. And just something you do just to have fun and just go out. We'd go out and like late at night and go to like cemeteries or certain places and just, I guess, ghost hunt. <laughs> Between football and ghost hunting, it's hard to imagine Troy has time for anything else. However, he shines in all facets of life. Well, Troy's been an outstanding young man. I mean, he's been a great example of a hard worker, a multi-sport athlete. He plays baseball as well as football. A student athlete, uh, he carries a 4.4, 4.5 GPA in, in some extremely rigorous courses. And he's a great role model for that young man that uh, wants to challenge himself both academically and athletically. With those credentials, Saugus' star running back won't be hearing any boos in the near future. After high school, Troy has an interest in studying biomedicine in college. But until then, the second baseman hopes to improve upon his 300 batting average during the upcoming baseball season. For the Cronkite Sports Bureau in Los Angeles, I'm Trevor Zeiler.